Hey, I'm back. Facebook Live, how you doing? Just pulling up to the trail. I'm actually going to go riding. Going to ride this thing and head down that trail and then up that mountain and then down the other side. And Wanted to talk to you about ownership. There's pride and ownership. And more importantly, um, we may have more time than money, even if you have a lot of time. Now, here's, here's the thing. I've asked this question before. Would you rather have more time or more money? And that answer changes depending on age. But my point about ownership and time is all you really have is time. And everybody's time's running out. But all you really have is time. All you really own is time. So my good friend Kendall Ficklin says you're either spending time, wasting time, or investing time. And those are three powerful statements about time. But the thing is, the time is yours. The time is now, the time's always now. So I'm gonna go ride. I'm gonna go ride up this big hill, through that trail, whatever. Then I'm going to hop off my bike, shower up, go to, some, go to an appointment, meet some clients, do that thing. So here's what I want from you. I want you to ask yourself, what am I doing with my time? What am I putting off till later? What am I, quote unquote, waiting for? A lot of us wait. And I like waiting. I'm learning patience. But I only, actually I don't like waiting. I take that back. I don't mind waiting as long as someone is doing something about what they're waiting for. If they're doing, if you are doing something about what you're waiting for, then yes, it's only a matter of time. You are spending, investing your time wisely. And waiting is okay. Patience is okay because you are doing something about it. However, if you are sitting on the couch, if you are just waiting for that magical phone call to come, if you were just waiting for the dollars to drop out of the sky, if you're just waiting to be happier, if you're just waiting to get better and not doing anything about it, well then you better be patient as hell. So, with respect to that, Josh, heal up. Brian, how you doing? Frank, thanks for joining in. So with that said, on this December, very beautiful day, Tom, thank you. I'm going to go ride my GT bicycle, suffer a bit climbing up, go fast as I can going down, got the, uh, got the knee pads on with my kit, I'll change my shirt, but that's the message, pride and ownership, own your time. I don't know how much money you have, whether you have a lot or little, and I will challenge anybody on this, own your time. It is invaluable. Own it. Take care. Elliot, good to see you. I want to see more. You haven't been posting in a while. Um, own your time. If you want to reach out, I suggest you contact me. I've had three, four people commit to the program. I'm working with 10 people in the first six months. That's a high level one on one coaching engagement with me. Pretty much unlimited um, contact with me. So, Four verbal commitments, strong commitments. So we've got four people on the program. I have six spots open, uh, and I will leave those open through January 10th. So contact me either through my website, drjasonrichardson.com, or you can always private message me on Facebook. I will contact you and get back to you. Um, but yeah, take ownership of your time because there's a lot you can do in this life right now. And right now... I'm going to go turn some pedals, jump some doubles, climb some hills, and then get back to work. Or wait, did I stop working or am I always working? I don't know, but that's the beauty of it. You can too. You can do this too. Everybody can. I'd love to teach you how. Mindset. Peace. Take care.